The Geoscience Research Institute is a creationist institute of the Seventh-day Adventist Church that specializes in "...original research and the study of scientific and biblical literature." Founded in 1958, it is located on the campus of Loma Linda University in California. In keeping with the teachings of the Church, they have a young Earth creationist agenda, with beliefs based on a literalist interpretation of the Genesis creation narrative and rejection of the scientific theory of evolution from a single ancestor for all life forms. History The Geoscience Research Institute began in 1957 with the forming of a Seventh-day Adventist Committee on the Teaching of Geology and Paleontology, which selected biologist Frank Lewis Marsh and chemist P. Edgar Hare to inaugurate courses in those fields, promoting the religious beliefs of the Church. The GRI was officially founded in 1958 and was originally located on the campus of Andrews University in Michigan. After comparative anatomist and paleontologist Richard M. Ritland was added to the group in 1960, differences in approach soon led to disagreements over whether it was permissible to reinterpret biblical and prophetic accounts in light of scientific evidence, with Hare and Ritland supporting that view while Marsh favored the historic Adventist interpretations. After a number of years of acrimony, Hare decided in 1964 to remain with the Carnegie Institution, where he had gone to conduct laboratory studies. Although Hare chose to continue in the Adventist Church, his views leaned toward theistic evolution. Also in 1964, Ritland outmaneuvered Marsh to become the head of the institute, and Marsh was transferred to Andrews University. By the late 1960s, Ritland's more flexible approach fell out of favor with a new and more doctrinally rigid church president, Robert H. Pearson, who laid down the following guidelines. Such constraints led Ritland to resign as GRI director in 1970 and join Marsh in the biology department at Andrews University. Ritland was replaced by Robert H. Brown, a physicist who eagerly committed the institute to the more apologetic mission of showing that Earth originated within six consecutive rotations of the planet no more than 10,000 years ago and experienced a universal destruction as portrayed in Genesis chapters 6–8". Brown was fascinated by radioactive time clocks. He dismissed radiocarbon dating that contradicted church doctrine but embraced evidence suggesting that the raw materials of Earth were billions of years old. His views, described as schizoid, by science historian Ronald Numbers, displeased both young Earth conservatives such as Marsh and Robert V Gentry and liberals such as Ritland and Hare. Numbers nevertheless states that Brown's achievements included, "...polishing the tarnished image of creationism", especially compared to the "...sometimes slipshod presentations." Of the Institute for Creation Research, Brown's successor, Ariel A. Roth, moved the institute to Loma Linda University in 1980. Both Brown and Roth dedicated the institute to salvaging flood geology and repeatedly dismissed scientists skeptical of its credibility. Publications. The Institute's journal Origins was published between 1974 and 2008. Topic Notes. Stewart, Melville Y. Ed. 2010. Science and Religion in Dialogue. Malden, M.A.: Wiley Blackwell. ISBN 978-1-4051-8921-7. 
LCCN 2009032180. OCLC 430678957